You draw first. My mother taught me this. I used to sit with her outside and watch the hills appear on the paper beneath her fingers. She guided her pencil so delicately. I imagine that God used such gentle strokes when he traced out those same mountains at the dawn of creation. It is a sacred thing. I can never bring myself to throw paint on a canvas without knowing exactly where each color is meant to land. Art is not reckless. At present, I absolutely want to paint a starry sky. It often seems to me that night is still more richly colored than the day. It has hues of the most intense you know, violet, blue, green. Have you ever looked closely at the stars? If you only pay attention, you will see that some stars are lemon yellow, but others pink, green, having a, a blue forget-me-not brilliance. I sit so often staring at that window, at the night sky, looking at the swirling colors. And if I close my eyes, I can almost conjure their brilliance to mind. But I can't see it, not yet. It's always hard to see in the beginning. That first look is truly the most difficult to conceive. But once you have a glimpse, a silhouette, everything falls into place. The colors fade in slowly, becoming more and more vibrant. The contours will shape themselves when the brush hits the canvas. But the beginning, the beginning is truly perhaps the most difficult part of all.